we uh, are fortunate to have two uh, dedicated biplane uh, angio suites to support a very busy endovascular practice. We have two endovascular neurosurgeons, uh, Brian Ho and Spiros Blackburn. We are a, a stroke center at the University of Florida, and we get a significant volume of acute ischemic stroke uh, patients uh, that we treat with uh, endovascular uh, thrombectomy or intraarterial therapy. We also uh, treat a significant number of patients with cerebrovascular conditions, such as cerebral aneurysms, uh, AVMs, uh, and we perform uh, endovascular uh, embolization procedures uh, for those patients. Uh, and all of these uh, uh, cases are available uh, for our residents uh, to scrub in and uh, take part in, uh, as well as to pursue dedicated uh, uh, time, elective time, uh, pursuing endovascular neurosurgery. The treatment of, of aneurysms is a, a pretty small subspecialty within, within uh, neurosurgery, and it is primarily being done at uh, major academic centers. Um, the University of Florida is one of those major academic centers. We do uh, the third largest volume of subarachnoid hemorrhage care in the country, and that's because we draw patients from all over the southeastern United States. We also have an endovascular radiologist, Chris Ferment, and, and between the three of them, they do upwards of a thousand endovascular uh, cases a year, and around 400 aneurysmal uh, cases a year, providing our residents uh, and our fellows with a wonderful opportunity uh, to become completely educated and competent uh, in endovascular surgery by the time they finish the basic training program.